Wouldn't life be easier if we were all the same? If we all spoke the same language? Wouldn't we avoid so many of the conflicts and rifts that destroy our relationships? If we all shared a common culture, wouldn't we all be much better off? Too often Christians have hoped for a time when our differences would cease, when in Christ we would all be indistinguishable. Such impulses are earnest, but fundamentally misguided. The story of Pentecost in Acts 2, 1 through 21, helps us understand how God sees human diversity. Simply, diversity is one of God's greatest gifts to the world. At Pentecost, early followers of Jesus gather in Jerusalem, along with fellow Jews from around the Mediterranean world. Suddenly, tongues of fire descend from the heavens. The gift of the Spirit precipitates an extraordinary event. As the disciples proclaim the good news, everyone hears the good news proclaimed in their own language. That is, God meets us in the messiness of different languages and does not ask us to speak God's language. Instead, God chooses to speak our many languages. God does not speak in a divine language beyond our comprehension. At Pentecost, God speaks in Aramaic and Greek and other ancient languages. Today, God continues to speak in Spanish, Greek, Hindi, and Chinese alike. God joins us in the midst of the messiness and the difficulties of speaking different languages, eating different foods, and living in different cultures. That is good news indeed. So let us set aside the prejudices that infect our relationships with one another. They are poisons that only lead to hatred and destruction. But let us also set aside the equally infectious, equally destructive delusion that our differences are a problem to be solved. That the solution to our many problems is a colorblind society where, as Stephen Colbert so brilliantly satirizes, we quote, don't see race. Such a dream is just as harmful as rank prejudice, for they both work on the same logic. It is better to be the same than to be different. For Christians, nothing could be further from the truth.